Caliph, do you know the word yes, Caliph? Yes, Caliph, Caliph. Yeah, we, yeah. we don't have yeah. one, so I'm, I'm, put, I'm running yeah. for it. You're the Caliph? Yeah. I'm running for it. So you're going to murder the Kafir? No, no, no. no. You, you, know, you, murder the kafir. you know me, you know me, I'm, I'm a friendly guy. You're a friendly guy, yes. Yeah, yeah, so you're yeah. not going to murder the kafir, that's okay. I'm not, no, 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 I don't tell, I'm friends with everybody. Wait, are you the successor of you Ali? What happened? Wait, 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 Sorry? The are you the successor of Ali and Uthman? No, no, not really, because Muslims should have a leader always, you know, and every time. They should have a leader. And he's called Caliph, Imam, you know. So today we don't have one, so we, we need to get one. So why do you think you should be leader? Because uh, many reasons. One of them is nobody wants to come forward, so I'm coming forward. Uh, I'm th I think I'm good enough to be the Caliph. Yeah, but you're not, you're not Shia. I've got to... Come on, brother. No, come on, come on, Sunni brother. Islam has come Imam on, also, has Khalifa. You have Khalif. Sunni, but you Sunni. deny Ali. You take Aisha's side in the battle of the camel. Look, Sunnis always had Khalifa. Abu Bakr was Sunni. Hmm. Umar, Uthman, they were Sunni. So from the time the Prophet died until today, yes, we should Allah. have one every time. But wasn't Ali the last Allah. Caliph? Look, he, it was the last of pe certain periods, certain era. Hmm. Certain era. But that doesn't mean we don't have a leader after that, you know, we have to have a leader after that. So you're caliph, but you have no horses, you have no money, you have no uh, women, maybe you have one woman, I don't know. How are you going to take over this country with your caliphate? Look, if, you, if, you, if, you, if, you, if your questions are like this, we cannot continue. Your questions has to be better than this, you know. What do you mean? I ask a basic question. Where is your money to form caliphate? Well, you have to start small, you know. You have to. It's not about money. There's only one, there's only two of you here. There's no, there, how, wh who else is in your caliphate? You, you never know, we might grow tomorrow. You never know. So yes, and what will that caliphate be based upon? Based on freedom, freedom. Equality, 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 order. Order? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Would you impose Sharia? Uh, not the way you, you have in mind, you know. Not the way you regard Sharia. For me, Sharia is being good, being nice, being respectful to others. So the women have to wear hijab? It's a, their personal choice. They have the choice to a hijab. Yeah. The women have to. They, they do, leave their hair out. Do do Muslim women have to only marry Muslim men? I think uh, that's. Uh, you, look, I'm. I'm I want to be a leader. I don't want to be a prophet. Do you, Do you know the difference there? Yes, I know the difference. Yes. I cannot interfere in the teachings of the religion. Mm. For example, the rules of the religion. I cannot change them. So you would fight the unbelievers? I, I no no. I'll fight whoever fight me. But why does the Quran say you fight the unbelievers? The Quran says fight those who fight you. You know this verse? Yes, yes, I know that. Fight those who that's the main principle in this. That's for the children of Israel, bro. Okay. Yeah, that's the thing. You read your Quran out of context. It says, well, it says well, look, children of Israel, you fight who attacks you. I, I'll do Islam the way I see it. Not the way you see it. So you're doing taqwi on the verse? And you so so Islam is based upon you. Your tough shit. No, no, no. If, if everybody has his own way of looking at Islam. As a caliph, I'll continue to do that, you know. So I'll do what I understand of Islam, not what you understand or others. If you're a caliph, we have many women in your palace. You must have a palace. I'm not going to have a palace. Not You're not going to have a palace? How are you going to be a caliph with no palace? Nah, caliph don't have I might have an office, you know, a small office. Will, 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 you, have, will you have an army? Not mine, no. No. Not yours. There are, there are 50 Muslim countries. They stay the way they are. They all have armies. So, but how can you be a caliph with no army? I'm going to bring them together and make them work together. Yeah, look at so the you're going to bring the Shia and the, the Sunni as well together? Yeah. Yes, I want to see the map actually. Let's show see the map. Yeah. <laughs> so you're, you're going to make Somalia your caliphate? No, this is a different topic. This is just different topic. This is the this is the map of uh, the Muslim them, world. You know? That's the Somalian Republic. Somalia. <laughs> that, that's Somali Somaliland Republic. Yes, this, is, this is different. Right. This is different. This is the Muslim world. So the Muslim world is going to be Somalia. No, no, no. It's, it's, it might have a, a Somali leader. Somali leader. Yeah. Well, he's the leader. He's the caliph. He's the caliph. You're the caliph, right? So you're going to be the leader. Might have, might have. Yeah. Yes. Are you going to take over this country with a caliph? No, no, no. no. You won't take over any country with a caliph. And you're not going to force any women. No, no. So then, what's the point of your caliphate? How are you going to spread Islam, brother? Look, in, this, in Muslim world, we have civil wars. You're going to Middle East. You're going to Middle East. Yeah.
fair enough. Look, we have in the Muslim world, we have many civil wars. I'm going to stop these things, you know. I'm going to stop them. I'm going to stop uh, the, all the negativities that exist there. So will you, would, you, would you side with the Shia and the Ahmadiyya or the Qadiani? I leave, leave them to whatever they choose, you know. I'm not going to interfere in their madhabs, you know, or their way, you know. Why would you do that? They don't believe. They're not following the Prophet. Look, my job as, a, as an imam is not religious, it's political, political, political. But you're a caliph, a caliph yes, of what? Political, I'm not a prophet, so it's political, it's going to be political. It's purely political. political. So it's nothing to do with the Sunnah or Hadith or the Quran. Religion will be a personal thing between the individual and God. So I, I can be part of a caliphate or your caliphate and follow Jesus? Yeah, if you're a citizen, you will have full citizenship, full rights. So I'll be able to preach my religion in your caliphate as well? No, that's, look. You deal with Islam, you don't deal with me on that. You deal with but Islam. But I'm actually you, it's your caliphate. It's not Islamic caliphate, you I, don't, political. I don't run Islam, I run politics. Yeah, but you said your caliphate was political, right? You're the head of the nation, so I have to well, come to Muslim you to free. Well, if Muslims say to you, you cannot propagate any other religion, so I can't uh, have a problem with that. So you have to accept what the Sunnah says? I can't change them in this way, you know, I can't change But the Sunnah them. says you are called to fight. The unbelievers, <laughs> until they feel themselves submitted and pay the jizya. Um, no, not really. No, I don't see it that way. You see it that way. I don't see it that way. You know what? You're Kadiani. He's a Kadiani. Is he a Kadiani? Are you a Kadiani? <laughs> no. You are a Kadiani. I'm a Sunni. You're a Sunni. Yeah, he says he's a Sunni. He's not a Kadiani. He sounds a bit like a Kafir. I'm not going to lie. You do, brother, because you have to keep the deen to be a caliphate. Right? You can't be a caliphate and not keep the deen. You understand what I'm saying? He wants to take Egypt, Algeria, all of them. So what's the promise? What have you got to say to the people today about... Promise, uh, Muslim, Muslim, the Muslim world is going to be a friendly land where you can go and live. And I preach. Promise. <laughs> that's, that's up to the, the locality. <laughs> the, up to the loc I don't decide. It's, uh, <laughs> so there you have it. Does anybody want to join um, Saeed's Caliphate today? Does anybody want to do that? Right, as long as you don't hurt anybody no, and restrict no. anybody's freedom. You know me, you know, okay. you know me, you know me. Yeah, me, but, but again, you said you're not going to impose anything on the religion. So, I mean, you'll you follow Sharia. Yeah, but those are Muslim countries, anyway. All of them. Yes, no, yes. Actually, Israel is not. But if he's a caliph, he's going to have a lot of people behind him. No, it's Israel, Palestinian. It belongs to Palestinian. Yeah, but uh, Palestine's not Israel. Yes, it's a big They included it in there. Hmm? You. Well, I, I couldn't hear that. It's a bit greedy. You have 50 countries. You collect the Jewish people uh, as a tiny bit in that land Jewish. for themselves. What's the manifesto, though? What are you, you going to do then? Oh, you got a manifesto. I like that. Okay, let me read this out. I will unite the Ummah regardless of sex. That's, that's going to be near enough impossible. But yeah. I will leave each sex to follow its doctrine. Wait, hold on. Doesn't Muhammad say there'll be 72 sex and only one will be Muslim? I'm not going to interfere. I'm not going to force... You said you would no, no. unite the Ummah. That's what he says. Look, you cannot force religion or belief or anybody. If they choose that... They... But you said you will unite the Ummah. It's not pointless. You're, you're, you're continue, imposing. Continue, you're imposing. You're I'll imposing leave, the Mahadab. No, no. I said I leave them to follow their Madhab. Right, but it says I will unite the Ummah regardless it's politics, of sex. Politics, yeah, politics. politics yeah. Okay. I will leave each sect to follow its doctrine or school of thought. Fair enough. That's a, that sounds reasonable enough. I will put an end to their inner fight. How would you do that? I'm gonna. It's gonna be my wait, wait, priorities. Wait, 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 one, one of priorities. Yeah, but where are you this Priorities. It's gonna be priorities. Yeah, same. Prior my, my, my first priority. Yes, yes. So what? your first priority would be to put an end to their fighting. Yeah. But how would you do it? Bring peace. I'm gonna, I'm gonna see how I'm gonna do. It's gonna be something I want to. We'll see, we'll see, um, we'll see. No, 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 no. <laughs> I have to continue. do it. I'm, yeah, yeah. Step by okay. step, step, step by step. I will, I will peacefully solve all problems between them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you don't know what step one is yet. No, I know, but when I, when I, when I become caliph, I'm gonna, yeah. I'm gonna do my best to, to, to solve the problems. Yeah. I will, I will, one minute, one minute, one minute. I'm, I'm asking a question, it concerns me, yeah? So I, I'm asking a question, okay? I will not allow the West or anyone to military attack any Muslim country or continue to plunder resources. How would you do that without any army? No, no, we're gonna, we're, we have, what do you mean army? We have 50 armies, 50 countries, 50 armies. But you'd first have to unite all of the sex to do that. I'm gonna do that, yeah. And you haven't started that yet, this is the problem. How long do you think you're gonna be alive for? It's gonna take time. I mean, I'm not being rude, but it's gonna take a long time. Probably hundreds of years. Maybe, maybe. Uh, let's see, let's see. Yeah. So the next one is, I will bring back true brotherhood. 30 miles away. <laughs> 30 miles away. <laughs> oh, my bad. 
Uh, I will bring back really. true yeah. brotherhood. Oh, You've seen all Muslims, despite their many differences. So you will be okay, because you said at the top here. Shukran, shukran, shukran. Oh, it's nice. You said you said that you will leave each sect to follow its doctrine. Yeah. So you will be okay oh, with people. Just read it, read it first. People, and then uh, uh, allow me to finish. Okay, I'm off again. Okay. So you'll be okay with people praying to Ali, right, in a Shia movement. You know when they go Ya Ali, they hit their chest, they walk around naked. Well. I'm okay with you worshiping Jesus. But it has nothing to do with me. You said you're going to unite the Muslims, not the Christians and the Muslims. Look, don't you know the Quran say, don't force your beliefs on others? But that, that's been abrogated. No, not really. Yes, no. it has. No, no, no. But Surah 929. No, no, no. Allah did. Then tell myself, Allah. Well, Allah says in Surah 929 of the Quran, fight the unbelievers until they feel themselves submitted and pay the jizya. That's different. But that doesn't make any sense because you said that we shouldn't. You know, Look, today, also, today we are rich. We don't need jizya today. You don't need jizya. Well, there is no country of jizya. That's the thing. Uh, I we don't, don't need jizya anyway. <laughs> like yeah, that's the thing. When the jizya abolished, so actually, is it what, what's going on with that? Yeah. Why is the jizya going to be abolished by Jesus? Come back. He's going to be with us. Is he going to abolish the jizya? I, I think so, yeah. But there's no jizya. There's literally no jizya in any country. Wait, would this go up? Jacob hasn't come back. So Allah failed his brother. Let's see, let's see, let's see. I mean, you'll have to see that. Maybe in the future there might be a jizya imposed, I don't know. But right now, come in the system. I'm not interested in jizya. Fair enough, fair enough. I will give all the pe their peak, their, sorry, it says I will give all their complete freedom and rights. Yes, yes. So that means every right to do anything, yes, right? Yes, yeah. So if somebody wants to, for example, according burn Quran, to the, According to the local law. The local, the local law. law? Yeah, according to... So in this country, but, but if I'm, I'm wanted to burn pro, a book... I'm a pro-freedom pro man anyway. Oh. So I'm going to promote freedom, more and more freedom. So in terms of blasphemy laws, in this country, you're not going to impose anything on this country, right? Of course not. You're in this it's country, right? Country, so if, if somebody was to burn a Quran or say stuff about Muhammad, would you say that nobody should impose a law on them? It's up to the British government to make that law. It's nothing to do with us. Yeah. But would you say that there should be a law to stop that? I d I'm not saying anything. I'm not saying anything. Fair enough. <laughs> no comment. Are you a Christian? Okay, so the last bit, I'm not going to read all of it. I'm just, I'm just promoting you a bit here. Look at the last couple. Last the last, I'll, 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 I'll read the last couple. Start from uh, right. okay, religious leaders. Okay, religious leaders will not be allowed to interfere in politics. Running the affairs of the country will be left to politicians. Right, so the, the people running the country, they can't be religious? Is that what you're saying? Yeah. Sure. They can't be religious in any way possible? No. So they've got to be neutral? They, yes, they have to serve everybody because I, the country belongs to everybody. So in your colour so they, they have to mm, provide services like clean streets, hospitals. So that has nothing to do with the religion. Jobs, factories, you know, open factories. What about Saudi Arabia where you can't show public the space? There's a lot effective. of wrongs in Saudi Arabia, a lot of bad... Mm wrong things that need to be corrected. What about those who are openly gay? Would you allow for gay marriage in your country or your caliphate? Gay marriage? Yeah. <laughs> no, no. no, no. Why, why wouldn't you? It's That's a, interesting. It's a, no, no, no. We're Muslims. We don't allow. Islam doesn't allow. It's not about me. So this it's is based Islam. upon Islam then, isn't it? No, no. No, Islam say I can't, I can't, I can't allow something that is forbidden in Islam. But you said you would not force your beliefs on people. Because Allah say, don't don't do that. Because so then that's for, but you stop him from being gay is forcing your belief upon him. I'm not defending gay marriage. I'm not no, saying no, it's a good thing. I'm just saying we cannot we cannot uh, allow him, uh, to be honest. We cannot Would allow you allow gays in or? <laughs> you must. <have. laughs> yeah, you allow gays in or? No, 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 at all. Uh, you're not allowed gays in. As a Muslim, talk. I'm against these things. You know. Okay, fair enough. So you'd have sort of like an Islamic caliphate, but without the force. That doesn't make any sense. Without the force, yeah. Without the force, okay. And then obviously, there'll be no intelligence agency that spies on the public. It will be directed to fight crime. Belief or lack of it will be made a personal thing between the individual and God. No one will be oppressed or discriminated against in any way, shape, or form because they don't believe. So that isn't, of course, going after gays, saying that they shouldn't marry, a form of oppression. Do you, do you accept gay marriage? No, I don't. I'm a Christian. So why you have problems? I'm asking this? you the question. No, I, I told you, it's, uh, I don't, me, I'm like you, I don't accept it. Okay, I don't accept it, but I can't impose that law on them. You're supposed to have run in a caliphate. Yeah, because, um, 
break. Well, you need a break. Yeah, yeah, You're tired, brother. No, we're almost finished now. Okay, but we're almost finished, bro. I'm happy to continue. Hold on, no, the PR. Wait a minute. I'm happy to continue. Okay, okay, let's continue. Maybe after. Maybe after. Okay, so you said you. My friends here is working with me. Yeah, fair enough. You said that you wouldn't. Don't make the video long. Too long. It's not going to be long. Don't worry about it. So yeah, you you won't make any individual be oppressed or discriminated. Christian is my brother. So if a Christian, a Jew is my brother. if a Christian wanted to burn a Quran in your caliphate, would you allow for him to be uh, put to death? Or, it's up no? to the local country or local government to decide. But you're saying you stop oppression? I don't know him. Ask him a question. He's here. How are you? All right. I'm good, man. How are you? Sorry, sorry. Don't run. Remember, the question was like you said yourself that you wouldn't stop oppression, and I asked you if somebody was to burn a Quran in your caliphate, Look, would you allow? Even the for them Bible to is not allowed to be burned. It's not allowed to be printed. Even the burned. Burnt. Yeah, yeah I, I would agree. It's not supposed to be burnt. In Islam, but, we don't burn anything. But, but you're saying that you Bible, would give people rights to, to not being oppressed, right? So that means they should be allowed to do it in your country if they want to, right? Okay. You see, do you think, uh, do you see it that way? I'm, I'm asking you. You said you want to oppress people. I've got one more, one more question. One more question. And that's it, right? Okay. I will sort out the Israel issue. So how are you going to do that? I'm gonna. Then it's possible. It's possible. It's possible. I think it's possible. But how, how would you do that? Have you got any sort of stage one, stage two? Uh, I think uh, I, I believe in. I believe I can solve any problem if I put my mind to it. Fair enough. A lot of five-year-olds say that as well. <laughs> Fair enough. Well, anyway, God bless you, bro. I'm gonna walk. Thanks for the interview. Bro. God bless you, man. You missed it, man. Okay. What am I doing now? I can't believe in religion. Fair enough, why don't you believe in religion?